everyone and welcome to this week's episode of Boozy Bakers. We have a very special episode tonight. Yeah. I feel like we always have a special episode. This one's <laughs> They're all super special. special. But this one's super special and mm -hmm. tell us why. Okay, so we're doing another bridal shower cake, but this one is actually for my nephew Kevin and his fiance Leanna. They're getting married. Aww. Her bridal shower is this weekend. Yay. So we're going to do a cake and cupcakes to go along with their winery theme where they're mm. having their wedding. So it's going to be there super cool. There is wine cool. all over this episode. All the wines. All the wines. All right. Okay, tell us about this drink. I'm so excited okay. about this drink because this is a super this. cool drink. Yes, so this is a blackberry red wine spritzer. Mm -hmm. So you'll notice here we have our two glasses. They're a little frosty because we have pre-made, if you guys can see, oops, Look at I this. just tilted it. It is a red wine ice ball. Ice so I used ball. a scotch what? ice ball, sphere, whatever, mold, and I did one part water to three parts wine. This is so Pop cool. it in the freezer, let it freeze for, give it at least a good overnight to freeze because they're still real crisp, well, not crispy, but like, like what's the word? Like a little bit slushy? Yeah, slushy. A little slushy. Um, but. but they did harden up, so that's in there. And then we are going to do, I added this, it wasn't originally in it, but <laughs> shocker. Shocker, we Some added vodka. Blackberry vodka, so Yay. one ounce of, oh wait, actually before I do that, I steeped some blackberries in this blackberry liqueur. So I let those sit in the fridge for a while and I'm just going to scoop My God. a few out and put those I in, maybe get a little bit of. Ooh, the juice. The juice. Yes. I want so many big ones. I These are the biggest the blackberry blackberries. Everything. I love them so much. I like blackberries. Well, Ooh. I mean, I don't like to eat them. I like the flavor of them. They're so good. Shocker. I don't like something. I know. Something. You don't like to eat something. Yeah. Get you one more. You do put a lot of seeds in your teeth. I'll give you that. Oops. Sorry. I just elbowed your boob. That's okay. And we'll give you some of the liqueur. Okay. Now we will do one ounce of our blackberry vodka. This is going to be so good. Pinnacle was the only brand that I could find that made blackberry vodka. Also, they don't have it around here, so I had to special order it. Of course. And I'm spilling. Pinnacle it is. Ooh. All right. The vodka's already turning purple. And then next ingredient is some of this bubbly sparkling water in blackberry flavor. So you're just going to fill this to almost the top. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. What a great bridal shower drink. Isn't it though? I it thought it was super cute. Perfect for a bridal shower. And then we're just going to throw a couple of frozen blackberries on the top just to keep it chilled. Ooh. Purple paper straw. Might want to try to stir, although that ice cube's probably going to be a little difficult. Ooh, it's a getting little a little difficult. slushy though. Yeah. Oh, I love it. Ooh. All right. Look at that. It's so purple. It is. Mm. Let's try this. I've been waiting so long for I know, this. I know. This, this is, is so like fun. one of my favorite recipes. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, 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 that is so delicious. Favorite, that is incredible. favorite, favorite of all the videos. Favorite. Is it your favorite? It is my favorite. It's so like flavorful. All time favorite? All, all, time. all time favorite. It's so flavorful. And I mean, it does require a little bit of preparation oh with the gosh. ice cubes. And this you don't incredible. really have to steep the berries. I just kind of did that because. Long story, fun. power outage today, had extra time, whatever. But yeah, this is really good. This was a fantastic idea, though, by the way. This Steeping is. Steeping the blackberries in this liqueur. So, so good. This is delicious, so you guys. Good. Highly, highly recommend. Can't recommend this enough. Two thumbs way, way, way up. Way up. All right. I'm going to chug this, refill it, clean this of up. Of course. And we'll be right back. Okay guys, we are back. So over here, I have the cake that I'm going to be decorating. And over here, Miss Courtney is going to be making cupcakes to go with it. So uh, I have an eight inch and a six inch red wine chocolate cake. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. This is my new mm -hmm. all time favorite chocolate cake mm -hmm. recipe starting now. It's like infused with red wine. It is super rich. It is it. so incredibly delicious. So I'm going to be doing this. 
Cord over here is making vanilla cupcakes. Okay. So I'm gonna get started icing this cake. I have it already crumb coated, obviously. Um, so I'm gonna put the icing on and start stacking it. So you, madam, take it away. So in the bowl of your know. mixer, what you're gonna I'm do doing. one stick of butter and a half a cup of vegetable oil. Okay. Mix that together. Okay. You know what? I need my bigger spatula. Out of here. Half a cup. Half a cup. Pardon me. Hmm? Half. No. Little bit more. Okay. Okay, and then you're gonna dump in one and a half cups of sugar. Wait, so I pour this in first? Uh huh. Do I need to mix it before nope. I put the sugar in? You're gonna mix the oil, the butter, and the sugar all together. Okay. All this whole thing? Yep, one and a half cups of sugar. And go ahead and give that puppy a whirl and whip it till it's nice and combined. Just low? Um, like low, medium, sure. I don't know what medium is. Two, four. Oh, four. like four. Four is good. Ooh. Ooh. How do I know when it's done? Just till, go until it's like a little bit fluffy. Okay. Ooh. It already smells good. Nice. It smells better All than right. butter and sugar. I think that's good. Okay, so go ahead and turn that off, and then you're going to add four eggs, and you're going to add them one at a time. Can I just put them in this? It yes, feels... crack them into there, and you can crack one and then dump it in and just go like that one at a time. You still don't trust me? I don't even trust myself. You know what? I'm doing two because I didn't get a, cr a okay. thing in this. A Go shell. on, girl. I'm basically a professional now. You get it, girl. You are. Oh, no shells. Ooh, can we go four for four? Let's see. Please don't jinx it. <laughs> but we are three for three. Nice. Super proud of you. Thank you, thank you. I need to stir this. It's been four so for four. Whoop, whoop. Dump those in. Yeah, go ahead. I need to stir this a little bit. <laughs> Nicely done. Okay, mix. Okay, now mix it up and let it go for a minute until it's nice and fluffy. How high? A little higher. Maybe a four. Yep. Ooh, there you go. This is serious, guys. I don't want to know what 10 is like. You don't. You know what 10 is like? 10 is like whatever's in there is all over your Why kitchen. Why do they even do that then? I don't know. Is that good? Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's good. Okay, and since these are vanilla cupcakes, you're going to now add one tablespoon of vanilla extract. Okay. Which sounds like a lot, but no way. I love vanilla. vanilla and you can't have too much I vanilla. I love all vanilla everything. Ever. Nope. Done and done. Perfect. Okay, so go ahead and give that a little whippy whip. Okay. Okay. Stirry stir. Okay, go ahead and turn that off. Now what you're gonna do is measure out um, how much? Uh, one and a quarter cups of buttermilk into this guy. Does it only do? Oh yeah, one and a quarter. Okay. Okay, so put I need buttermilk to shake in there. This. I would, yeah, I always do. I don't know if you need to or not, but I always do. Can't hurt. Cannot hurt. And one and a quarter, a quarter. cups. Yep. Oh. Very thick. Super thick. Okay, dump it in. It's like my thighs. Girl. Super thick. Bye. Dump it in. Okay, no, not yet. Okay, so you're gonna alternate. Now we're gonna add the dry ingredients. So you're gonna do half of this in there and then mix it just a little bit and then half of this. Mix that a little bit and then come back and do the other half, other half. This thing's okay? massively in my way. I know. 
So you just have to kind of use your hand or a spoon and just dump in like half of it. You know how I feel about this. I know. Mm. Secretly hoping it's getting under your nails. It is. I don't, I really don't like this texture. Oh, it's making me gag. It makes my fingers feel dry. Oh, I don't like it. Flour? <laughs> I don't like it. It makes my fingers feel Ooh, dry. And I thought I was weird. Okay, is that half? Well, I am weird. Uh, uh, yes, that's good enough. Oh, I don't Close like it. enough to half. And then whip it on low, very low. I hate it. Don't make me do that again. Until next time. I until won't. Until never. I won't until next time. Until never. All right, so. Oh, it's like doughy now. Well, okay, sort of so turn that of. off. Or you can actually leave it running since it's on low and add in half of the buttermilk. Okay. Okay. And then once that's pretty much incorporated, then you're going to go ahead and add in the other half of the dry ingredients. Okay. This and drink then, is so good. I know. It is so freaking delicious. I made my husband try it, and he didn't like it. He said, eh. You I know mean, what? it's I don't good. I really like wine. We're like, what do you know? Who buddy? are you? What do you why, know? Why are we here? How do you know what's good? Why are we married? You don't Seriously. like wine. Oh, I have to touch it again. Blah, blah, blah. All right. Mix again with the rest of the powder. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Just until it's incorporated. Okay. And then you're going to dump in the remaining half of the buttermilk. Okay. Do I need to put it up higher or no? Nope. Just leave it here? Yep, that's good. Okay. Do I need to get this stuff off the sides? Oh, we're gonna do that last. Okay. We're gonna scrape down the sides and make sure everything's incorporated once we're all done adding all the ingredients, which is pretty much now. Nope. Okay, that one's ready. All right, done -zo. Okay. Perfect. Well, it's mixing, but Almost done -zo. I'm done with the ingredients. Okay, grab your other spatula, like this one. The magic spatch. Yes. I got the magic spatch. That oh my god, I love that song. song. The magic stick. I love that song so much. <laughs> <laughs> it's so inappropriate and I love it. Okay, we're going to turn this puppy off. You want me to scrape? And then you're going to scrape all of that Ooh. yumminess off of there. <laughs> Oh, wait, what? What's happening? You gotta get both sides, girl. Okay, perfect. Now scrape down all the sides and then just give it a quick mix. Do we gotta go all the way? Does it stick all the way to the bottom? Oh, uh, yeah. It sure does. It sure it's does. a lot. It's a lot of work. It sure does. It's a lot of work. All right, let me get, get this down in out there. of the way for you. All right. Ooh, wait, where did my paddle go? Oh, wait, I do I just it stir it by hand? Yep, just by hand. Oh, yep. I thought you meant... Yes, ma'am. Look at this little... <gasps> Look at the wine ball. It's... it's getting slushy. Turning into like a popsicle that's like slushy. Oh, this drink just got so much better. Boom. Look at that. Vodka <gasps> and wine. Ooh, ooh. All right. Ooh, it's even better now. Do you want to make sure that that's stirred? Okay. No, that's good. Okay. Sure. Yep. You trust me. Positive. I trust you. I don't trust myself. I taught you, so of course I trust you. That was your okay. first mistake. Ha! No, <laughs> you're doing so good. So so good. Okay. I know. I steeped my own berries today. Who even am I? <laughs> She's steeping and folding on and my blending. Own. On I my know. Own. She Nobody had that idea. Nobody even told me to. I never told Just her to steep anything. It. She came up with that on her I'm own. I'm not really sure. How do you what? 
What is steeping exactly? Because I'm just not very sure that I impart flavor in a liquid. Do you have to put by something using else? Something else, like you, the liquid took on the flavor of the blackberries because you steeped it. So I didn't have to add anything else to it. No. Besides, no. It's for like some a reason, tea I thought I needed sugar. A hot cup of water. Oh, I thought I needed sugar. No. Well, good. Then I did steep. Lord God, no. I steeped okay. correctly. So now we're gonna scoop these puppies, mm -hmm. which you know how to scoop. Mm -hmm. You've done this many, many times. So. I have. Scoop away, girl. Scoop. Okay, guys, we're back. Our cupcakes are in the oven right now. And Amanda is going to show us how to stack the cake. And we're going to do a little bit of a texture on the side, too. Ooh, ooh. And I'm okay. going to drink. Oh, yeah, and you're going to drink. Okay. So in order to support the weight of the top tier, we have to put some supports in the bottom tier. So we have these cute little dowel rods here. Now I put this one in the center and I left it long because when I put the top layer on, it's gonna go up through the top layer too so it isn't gonna tilt or move, okay? So now we're going to take a couple more dowel rods, put it down in there and I'm gonna mark it with my thumb where it's at and go ahead and take it out and then I'm gonna cut it right there. Cut. Cut. Okay, so then I'm gonna go in and cut a few more the exact same size now we have these four little dowel rods so i'm going to do one on each side and then here and here so now when i put the top tier on this tier it's not going to just crush the bottom it'll be supported okay good so let's go ahead and stack this puppy we don't want that we don't want that no we don't okay so this little cake is on its own cake board so it'll be supported with these dowel rods so i'm going to come in here and cut the excess off of this cake board so we don't see it and you've already poked a hole in i the cake did board. i measured where the center was on this cake board and then i poked a hole in it so that I can just pop it on the top, right on that dowel rod, and it'll sit perfectly in the center. So smart. You're just so the smart. smartest. Thanks, girl. <laughs> okay. So now I'm gonna find my little hole and line it up here. And then this is the fun part. You just get it close to the bottom and you just, or that little lip that it formed at the top. And make it smooth but we don't want it like perfectly smooth it's kind of yeah, rusticky like looking rustic. with that yeah pattern okay? i like it so now i'm going to come down here and i'm going to do the thing. exact same thing on the bottom okay so soups cute oh, can we see that on camera oh i think we Ooh, can yeah yeah. Uh -huh. yeah super cute very love cute. that texture okay too. so you could very well leave it like this and obviously take a little bit of buttercream down here and smooth that out so you don't see that cake board. But it's for a fancy bridal shower. Fancy. Oh, oh. Super fancy pants. Oh, oh hello. Oh. Hello. hello. What's happening? The liar wants to come out and say, hey, girl. Wants hey. to come to the party we're having. You can't. Okay. Stay back. So Beast. we're gonna zhuzh Ooh. this thing up a little bit and add some pretty wine-colored ribbon. So pretty. Okay, so I'm gonna cut this janky end off. <laughs> okay, so in order to keep this, I was gonna in say there, I'm interested to see yeah. how this works. We have these pretty little pins with a little. Pearl, pearl. Oh, on the end. So pearl. not only does it keep it in place, but it actually it's looks pretty. Beautiful. So you just have to tell her, you know, hey, there's a pin in there. Don't eat it. Okay, well, so we just pop that little pin in. You win some, you lose some. True. So what if somebody eats True a pin? True story, girl. They're, they're not going to die. They're not going to die. They might but actually. They die? Yeah, they, they might. Could, they so. might. Okay. Ooh, whoa, whoa. Ooh, man down. Uh -oh. Grab it, girl. Okay, so I'm just going to put this here and spin very slowly until that is all the way around. And I'm going to cut off the excess. And then I pull oh. out this pin. Oh God, I thought I just ripped it out of your no, hand. No, no. Oh, Over, don't do that to me. Overlap it right here. And then just pop that little pin back in there. Okay? So now that becomes our official back of the cake. Okay? 
so cute. Isn't it the cutest it thing looks ever? So cute. It's so pretty. Okay, we're gonna do the exact same thing on the top. Okay. So we're gonna line up the back. Yep. Mm. So the back is the back all over mm -hmm. on both tiers. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna pop this pin in here. And then I'm gonna very slowly and gently spin, spin. Spin. Oh. Okay. Uh, Cut this off. About there. This is the cutest. Remove the pin. I want a cake like this. Overlap. And then put the pin back in. Will you make me a cake like this? Certainly. Just for fun? Yeah, why not? <gasps> Isn't that pretty? Look it's how much pretty. nicer that made it look. Like it made it look official it's, yeah, and like it's pretty very and finished. dressy. Okay, so we could. Leave it like this because obviously it's gorgeous that way. But but that's not how we roll. That's not how we roll. So we're gonna keep on keeping on. Okay, so we have all these pretty silk flowers. So Yay. we've used okay. fresh flowers before, but this these are silk, so the stems don't matter. Because remember when we used fresh flowers, yes, we was. had to like wrap the stems yes. or we just laid them on top so that it wouldn't get into the cake. So mm -hmm. this doesn't matter. These are just plastic. So we're going to zhuzh this up with some fresh flowers, but we okay. have a topper, right? We do have a topper. We do have a really pretty fun topper. Ooh, it's rose gold, which is my favorite thing He put thing a on ring Earth. on it. He put a ring on it. Uh, so uh, pretty. Uh. Okay, so we're going to, here's the back. We're going to line this up in the center. Cute. And pop this puppy on there. Oh, I love it. It's so cute. Okay, so now okay. that we have our topper on and our ribbons, what we can next? come in here and with just start start going nuts with the flowers. Go to town. Yeah. So we can do, some of these are pretty like mm -hmm. on the bottom and then put flowers on top. So we okay. can even come in behind here. I don't know if you want to do that. I don't know. You're the, I'm, I'm not good at this part. Does that look good there? Yeah. We could do that. Ooh, I like the little, yeah, the little fan things. Mm -hmm. I do too. Let's do Ooh. one here. Ooh. Ooh, that's so pretty. Okay. Let's do some flowers over here. Oh, yeah. Maybe do one it of up. these. Ooh, these are so pretty. Good picks are. with these flowers, girl. Okay. Ooh, well, to also go along with the fact that I can't bake, I also can't keep real flowers alive. So picking out fake flowers is one Girl, of my one of my talents and skills. I can't either. <laughs> I can't even water my hanging baskets, and they're all just dead. I so tried I have to once. buy hanging baskets two to three times a summer. <laughs> I just replace them because I can't keep them alive. It's absolutely I tried disgusting. Once. I gave up after one time. I was done with it. I'm like, nope, no more. It's terrible. No more. I'm so, I'm worthless when it comes to flowers. Yeah. I love it. I do too. Okay. There you have it. That's okay. done. Now we're done. Now, now we're done. Now we're done with the cake. Now let's move on to the cupcakes. All right. We'll be right we'll back be with right our back. cupcakes. Okay, guys. Now we have our cupcakes out. Um, we took them out of the oven and then we went ahead and put them in the fridge for a couple minutes just to make sure that they were nice and chilled so that when we put the frosting on it doesn't run and melt so look how pretty that color is too. i know it's, it's like a I don't little know if they, like a blush pink like a super super light pink pastel but like very feminine yes oh. it kind of matches your shirt it sort of does yeah. yeah i like it all right so what's the pattern we're doing on these just the normal just the normal like rosette did i start in the middle yep Squeeze, 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 and around, and then come up another layer. Ooh, look at you! Look how pretty! That actually came out really good. I know. I'm, I'm so really proud, proud of you. Of myself. I'm so proud of you. I don't want to jinx it though. You so are doing so great. I'm just going to shush. What for a, a good minute. student you are. <laughs> that is perfect. Honestly, that is like the perfect rosettes. <gasps> I'm so proud of you. Oh. I got a good teacher. Thanks, girl. Okay, 
continue on and then we have something extra special to really set these off and put them over the top. <gasps> Look at your rosette. Oh my God, I feel like a proud mom right now. I feel like a proud ah! child, child slash yeah. mom yeah. slash whatever. They're so pretty. All right, we're gonna, All right, we're gonna go ahead and finish these and then yeah. we'll show you what we're gonna put on top. So pretty. Okay, so now we Done. have these all frosted in these beautiful light pink so blush cutie. colored rosettes. So now, Court, what are we topping them with? So I found these cute little cupcake toppers in a rose gold glitter. You probably can't see, but we'll do a close up. So there is a so diamond ring. This one says, I do. And then this one says, love. Oh. So we bought an array of those and we are just going to, we did cut them a little. They were very long. We're just yeah. going to pop them right oh, down in. Oh, they're so pretty. Look at how cute. Let me do the ring. Oh my gosh, I love those. So cute. So, 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 so we'll cute. finish putting all those in there, but you guys yeah. get the idea. You get the gist. So this is our bridal, bridal shower cupcake spread. and cake. Dessert Spread. table. Oh, yes. yeah. Dessert table. Yes. All right, guys. I think that that's it. So that's we'll, a wrap. We'll link the recipe to this, which do Please it. Please do yourself a favor do and try it. this. It's and so amazing. And then if you do do it, comment below and mm -hmm. let us know how you liked it. Yes. And we're also going to link the recipe to the red wine chocolate oh, cake. Because and definitely try that one, too. Amanda it is, said it's too good not to incredible. share. Incredible. Absolutely incredible. All right, guys, thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And make sure that you follow us on all of our other social media pages as well. That's it. We'll see you next time. It's a wrap, guys. Bye. Bye.